Hi everyone. This is HT. Welcome back to our GNN video review. Today's we will reveal tons of new characters and new system chronographic trigger. Let's see new characters first, then new system. Two new characters we are looking on is Shakespeare and Nene. Shakespeare leader skill. Team skill. Active skill. Her bonding skill is dealing two extra attack. After this, rare jackpot Nene. Leader skill. Team skill. Active skill. Nene bonds are adding two combo and modify race runes. Coming up is a new challenge stage. There are five levels in this challenge which will open in two different phases. Let's see our champion card NKH. Active skill. Our champion also has team skill with Arthur. Next is our Echoing Shop character. This time, our evoking character can do exclusive DW. Let's see this exclusive DW. After this, Battle Pass character Tarinas. Before that, there are some optimization made on Battle Pass. Active skill. Next, Tarina's premium version. Outfit. Premium DW. DW skill review. Coming on is bi-weekly card. Active skill. Next is promotion of fully loaded package 2023. First Encounter Series, Trusty Buddies Series, Tenacious Verve Series, Credible Coadjutor Series, Last Pertinacious Belief Series. Last is our new chronographic system. Honestly, I also still processing this new system, but I prefer try it in the game easier to know this system. Here, let's us look this new system. First, we will have 10 new chrono cards in this system. Basic Introduction, 1. Cronin meter, it represented by star of a number of points, like 6 pointed stars or 8 pointed stars. At the beginning of a battle, one random runestone will be modified to become Cronin runestone. 2. Cronin runestone, it refers to the runestone that has the Cronin meter. It can be exploded, removed, and restored to normal state. Currently, swiping Cronin runestone will remove it from battle altogether. Next, FP point, points for activating the Cronin card's round effect just like in this picture after this is how this mechanic work in the game chronographic trigger brings three new effects that can be used during battle the effects are instant effect round effect and triggered skill first instant effect it moved the fully charged cronin runestone to a character's icon and stop runes movement right then that character will equip the cronin meter it also can equip to a character in boundary breaking cronin meter cannot be equipped to a combined character in addition Upon combining the Cronin meter will be moved back into the board next round. 2. Round effect. When a character is equipped with the Cronin meter, a special effect will be activated and stay in play at the cost of a number of FPs each round. When there are insufficient FPs in the Cronin meter, the Cronin meter will be removed from the character and returned to the screen as a Cronin runestone at the end of the round. 3. Triggered skill. The following effects will be triggered when the Cronin character runestone is dissolved in the first batch. Activate triggered skill. Clear FPs in the Cronin meter. The Cronin meter will return to the screen as a Cronin runestone. Here is how return Cronin meter back into the board. 1. The Cronin character runestone is not dissolved in the first batch. When this happens, following effects will occur. 
triggered skill will not be activated. FPs in the Cronin meter will not be cleared. The Cronin meter will return to the screen as a Cronin runestone. 2. The character with Cronin meter becomes disabled. When this happens, above effect number and will take effect. 3. The character is combined with another character. When this happens, above effect number and will take effect at the beginning of the next round. Next is Chronographic Card Series Their Skill Review. Alright, this is overall this week content. What do you guys think on these cards and new system? Comment down below and let me know. I am HT. See you again in the next video.